So here we are today at the Double Horseman and we've had the pleasure of inviting the Ebony Horse Club to uh, come and see behind the scenes and be able to show some of the trick riding, have an experience and really be able to kind of offer up like different opportunities. I think, you know, going moving forward with career paths, you know, we look at like equestrian disciplines of eventing or racing or dressage where no one kind of ever sees the film industry as a possible opportunity. So I think it's really nice to be able to show the kids today that it is a potential career path and especially it doesn't even, you know, coming from an inner city doesn't hold you back. When I saw them do the tricks before we had to do them on the trampoline, it was a bit daunting, but once I did it a couple of times myself, I was in my zone. Today we've had a great opportunity to bring some young people in and show them the world that exists, well, our world that exists, with uh, trick riding, carriage driving, four in hand, and lots of different things like that, and they got to have a go as well. I haven't really considered horse riding as like a full-time career, in my opinion. It was mainly more a hobby. It made me open my eyes and realise that there's a lot more in the horse industry than I actually thought. And seeing all of the like famous horses and like props from sets that have actually um, been like aired and stuff in like feature films and series on Netflix and everything, it's just so like cool and it's really given me an insight on what I could do in the future. One of the things we really try and do with these careers days is we don't just want it to be a trip and a kind of a watch, you know, something they can see on TV. We really want the kids to get involved and understand how it be to do this job, how it feel, um, and also what the opportunities for them are out there. No, it was absolutely brilliant and I can tell you they were, you couldn't get a better bunch of kids to come along. They were absolutely brilliant. They got involved. Also, they brought their own personality to it as well. I've never been to the London International Horse Show. It will be my first time, but I'm very, very excited to see what is to come. Already this day has given us a little taste of what we are to see, so I'm very, very excited. I am absolutely chuffed and thrilled to be going again this year because I just absolutely loved it. And it was just such an amazing day and like seeing all the horses and Queen's Cavalry and everything just working out together. It was like just so beautiful and amazing.